Hello and welcome to all my friends on the internet. I want to welcome you back to making money on the internet. What we're going to do today is cover something very brief. It's not going to take up much time. Uh, what I want to do is talk to you about obviously making money on the internet. Well, for one thing, let's use an analogy. I like to use a lot of analogies. Uh, you'll find that I'm from a real estate and mortgage background. So I like to use analogies. Let's say if, uh, if you're a home builder, if you're building that home, you're going to need certain tools. You're going to need hammers. You're going to need nails. You're going to need sheetrock. You're going to need concrete for pouring the foundation. You're going to need a whole myriad of things to build that house. Well, the same thing if you're a hairdresser. If you're a hairdresser, you're going to need your tools. You're going to need you know, a hair dryer machine. You're going to need your chemicals. You're going to need your you know, your, your nail clippers, whatever, whatever you're going to need as far as doing your job. You're going to need that. The same thing as I was saying a, a few moments ago in regards to building a house. If you're building a house, you're going to build a good house, you need tools. Well, what makes you think there's anything different than building a business on the internet? One thing that many people make the mistake of when they get started, you figure, okay, I've, I've, I've signed on with this company, it's MLN, and I've, and, and I've got their company website. That's all you got to do. Well, no, there's a whole lot more to it. And that's what I'm here to help you to find out to do. I'm here to help you do that. I mean, there's certain things on, on the internet you need. You need autoresponders, uh, squeeze pages or landing pages, what they're called. Uh, you know, there's a whole myriad of different things that you need to do. You know, there's, there's also, you know, different terminologies, pay-per-click and SEO and and how are you going to market. It's just like, even though, even if you, when you get your tools, you, you're not done yet. It's just like going back to the house. You can build the biggest, the best, and the most beautiful house in the world. But if nobody can see that house... The only one that's going to benefit from that is you. Now, if that house happens to be your, ben your, your business, you're going to starve. So it's more than just the tools. It's knowing how to use the tools. And it's how to get things going so that you can make money on the Internet. So that you don't have a website that nobody visits. That's what I'm here to help you to do. We're going to go over a lot of different things, not so much this time, but in the next video, in video's future, we're going to cover autoresponders, we're going to cover different forms of marketing, we're going to cover uh, Facebook marketing, MySpace marketing, Twitter marketing, we're going to cover a whole lot of different things, and I'm going to break it up into different segments. Oh, and by the way, uh, in case you're wondering about the music you're hearing in the background, I play that for a specific reason. Um, I'll tell you a little story before we, before we go on. I'll tell you a little story. Um, when I was a child, and also as I got older, uh, my mother, my mother was a child prodigy. She actually played at Carnegie Hall when she was five years old. She played the piano. Well, what she would do for me is she'd always play music for me. She'd play this particular song for Elise. Now this one that you're hearing right now, it's a it's a mix of it, so it's not the, the same one, not the original one, but I still like to hear the original one as well. So uh, God rest her soul. She she um she passed away several years ago, uh, but I always remember her whenever I play this song. But now getting back to the matter as a hand, um, I, that's why I like to play that music. It just reminds me of her. But getting back, like I said, getting back to matters at hand, what, what I'm going to do is help you or show you and point you in the right direction of what you need to get your internet business, whether it's online or offline, you're still going to need those tools. What we're going to do is cover autoresponders in the next video. I'd like to see you there.